Hey guys, what's up? Tim here, and today I'm going to show you a quick little terminal command that can pin your dock to the right, left hand, or middle part of your screen, like I have so below. So basically, if you're going to be doing some uh, desktop modifications and stuff like this, sometimes it's good to have your dock in different places on your desktop. So like, I'm running Geeklets right now, and usually I'll have this Geeklet down there, but for the sake of this video, I moved it up. So if you want to like make it look better and stuff like that, uh, you can pin your dock to whatever part of your screen you want. So basically all you're going to do is you're going to go into the description of this video and copy this command that you see right there, which is defaultsright.com.apple pinning something, whatever. So I found this uh, command a long time ago on a forum. I know another YouTuber did a video like this before, but trust me, I didn't get this from him. I've, I saw it and that's what basically sparked the idea for a video, but I've known this command for a very long time. And so basically what you're going to do is you're going to paste that command, and then you're going to do start, middle, or end. So start's going to make it the dock go to the left side of your screen, middle will go to the middle obviously, and end will go to the right side. And so for the sake of this video, I'm going to go start, and then you can click enter. So obviously nothing happened, uh, because basically what you need to do is refresh your dock. So how to do that is you can either restart your computer, or you can uh, type in this command, which is kill all and capital D O C K. And once I do this, it will flip to the left hand side of the screen. As you see there, it works pretty smoothly and it's very easy. So if I want to go back, obviously I can just click paste and then I can go end, enter, and then kill oh whoops, one word, kill all dock. Does it again? very easy and uh, just an example of what you can use this for I have my geeklet here and I'm just going to drag it down here so whenever I'm web browsing or anything like that I can just easily look right there and it's super easy to tell the time and the date or whatever you need for that so that's pretty much it guys and uh, I'll be getting back to my regular reviews once I get back from vacation but uh, I just wanted to give you guys a little something that you guys can try out if you're running a Mac and uh, yeah, that's pretty much it for today, guys, uh, and uh, thanks for watching. This is Tim, signing out.